everyone, I'm Hattie Taka, back for another round of Fair on the Channel, this time with my good friend Aita. Hello everyone, I'm Aika Manami, and I'm also here as a reappearance. Hattie's been really amped to fight me since my win against Shoji, so she's really been trying to get me to play on the channel with her, which I eventually agreed to. I can be very persuasive. Yeah, I know. Anyway, it looks like this time it'll be the battle of the girls to decide who's the best. Seems like it. But I'm gonna go ahead and call that I'm gonna come out on top. Really? You may be able to create a board out of nowhere, but I can wipe it all out in one fell swoop. Is that a challenge right here? Hmm. Only if you have to lose. Oh, this is gonna be so fun! Let's go ahead and get set up! Let's check on my hand. Draw! Hmm. Hmm. All these are really good cards. I think I'll keep them. So no mulligan for me. Your hand's that good, huh? Well, mine's not bad either, but I'll send this one card back just to make sure. Hmm. Okay, so this works. So Hayate, you ready to get this started? Oh, I'm more than ready! Ooh, I just can't wait! I've been waiting for this match for so long! I'm about to come at you with full force, Hanka! So I hope you're prepared for the winds of my renewal! Well, if you're gonna come at me with full strength, then my wearing machinery and I will stop your assaults in its tracks! Let's, Let's do, do this! this. Knowledge, Knowledge release! release. Grimoire, open. open! So you wanna take the first move I've got, or should I? Hmm, I think I'll go ahead and take it. Against you, I'm gonna need all this setup I can get. That means I'll get the first attack, so fine by me! Great, here we go! I'm starting this off! My turn! Draw phase! Main phase! Hmm, okay, that's the plan. I'll start off with this match by summoning scrap metal! I have my turn there. A level 1 construct with nothing else to support it? I can't call too much too early against you, Hayate. Fair! But since you're giving me the opening to attack, then I'll take it! It's my turn! Draw phase! Main phase! Yes! That's the perfect draw! Hmm? I'll start my turn with the spell Ferocious Wind! I send the top two cards of my song to the drops and I get to draw two cards! First card is Spirit's Blessing. The second card is Rite of Awakening. Now I get to draw two cards. Filling up your hand and your drop zone at the same time. Your Ferocious Wind sure is a powerful card, but with only runes in the drop zone, it doesn't do much for you. True, but who says I'm done yet? Huh? Thanks to those two cards, I can play a second Ferocious Wind, meaning I can draw two more cards once I send those next two cards to the drop zone. You got a second Ferocious Wind? That's right. Now we're time for the effect. The cards sent to the drops are a Necromancer Rayleigh and a Traveling Necromancer. You got a Necromancer to the drop zone. Then that means... You know it! But first I'll summon one of my favorite level 2s, Vicious Wrath! And with this effect we both discard one when he's summoned. So I'll discard my lovely Spectre! You would make me discard here. Hmm. I'll discard an Imitator Droid. Perfect! One card struck down! Now I'll follow up by using Vicious Wrath Renew! By discarding one from my hand I can special summon any level 1 I want from my drop zone! And I think I'll special summon the card I discard! So come on out! The god of the lost souls who transverse the barrier of life and death! My ace creature! Traveling Necromancer! You got Traveling Necromancer out already? It, it's fine. You don't have pay to use any of his effect. True! But I can do this! I to my attack base and attack through scrap metal with Vicious Wrath! Uh, I could, but it's not worth it right now. I'll no guard this one. Aim is check. Rule Maker Joy. No trigger. That's one Rule Maker down. Only three more to go. Now it's Necromancer's turn, and I'll have him attack you directly. Bring it on, Hayate. I won't guard this one either. Damage check. A heal trigger, so I get to recover one damage. A heal trigger now? I guess I don't get to push you to two damage then. But that's fine, because next turn I'll make sure to push you higher. I am my turn. The match is only beginning, and you're already fired up. I can't let you go too far ahead, otherwise I'll fall behind too soon. It's my turn! Draw phase! Main phase! Hmm. Okay. I have my turn here, Hayate. It's your turn again. Already? Well, think about it, Hayate. With only one damage, I can't do much with my song. And it would be more entertaining for the people watching if I managed to bring on my ace. Oh, I've got it. So you want to bring out all the stuff so everyone has a good time watching. You got it. Well, in that case, I'll make sure to give you enough damage so you can summon Ruinmaker. It's my turn! Draw phase! Stand phase! Main phase! Hmm. I can't do much here without pay, but I'll manage. First, I'll set up my rune, Great of Awakening! Next up, I'll discard my Clustered Phantoms in order to use Vicious Rash Renew again and bring back another Traveling Necromancer! Now, I'll summon my Lonely Spectre! I didn't think you'd actually go out and make a field over there, Hayate, when I said I wanted to summon Ruinmaker. Of course I would! If I'm going to deal you damage, I'm going to make sure I deal you as much damage as I can! I may be letting you summon Ruinmaker, but I'm still playing to win! Fair enough! Now let's do this! I'm heading into the attack phase, and I'll have one of my traveling necromancers attack you directly! No guard! Damage check! Construction droid! A construction droid! That's one come by user out, but knowing Aika, there's already one in her hand! Next, I'll have Lonely Spectre attack you directly! A no guard again! Damage check! Spare parts! Now here comes Vicious Wrath! No guard! Damage check! Defensive maneuvers! 
then here comes my remaining traveling necromancer, Shell Shock! I'm not going this one too! Damage check! It's a cube of technology, Shaylee! There we go! Five damage! You're halfway there! And with that, you should have more than enough to pay to summon Rune Maker Troy! I have my turn here! It's your move, Ika! Whew! Five damage already! I can't say I'm surprised, but the battle will only get tougher from here! But now, thanks to you, Hayate, I can bring out my ace to match yours! It's my turn! Troy face! Main face! First I'll summon Construction Droid, and since I have a second one, I'll summon another one too! Next I'll pay one to use Construction Droid's Combine 2, meaning both of them are destroyed, and I can special summon a level 2 construct for my song! So come on out! Mender Droid! Summoning Mender Droid from Construction Droid? I would have never thought of a play like that! I'm not done yet, Hayate! I'll follow up by summoning Imitator Droid from my hand! Two constructs whose total levels equal three! Here it comes! Now I'll pay two in order to use Mender Droid's Combine! By destroying both Mender Droid and Imitator Droid, I can bring out my strongest construct! Made up by the power of his friends, who bring us back from the spread of and turn the tables! I summon Ruin Maker Droid! You did it! You brought a Ruin Maker Droid! Great, but you shouldn't be so happy! When Ruin Maker enters the field, his effect activates and destroys all of the two lower creatures on the field! Go Ruin Maker! War of Ruin! What? No, I forgot about that! Sorry guys! I promise I'll bring you all back somehow. Don't forget, I'm still going, Hayate. I'm entering the attack phase and I'll have Ruin Maker attack you directly. And I'll pay one to add a gift check. I'll no guard this one. Then here's my gift check. A Mender Droid. No trigger. Damage check. Traveling Necromancer. No trigger. And I'm gonna turn there, Hayate. It's your move. Whew. So how do you like that? It was... It was amazing! The way you destroyed two construction droids to bring out Mender Droid and used it to bring out Ruin Maker Droid was insane! Not to mention you got rid of all my creatures in one turn, and Spit still had enough to pull off a gift check afterwards! <laughs> yeah, you should never underestimate my song. When the chips are down, that's when we really begin to shine. Right, and so does mine! So let's see if I can pull off a big move like you did! My turn! Drop phase! Main phase! Hmm. I'll pay one to set my rune. Spirit's blessing! I think I'll end it here for now. Really? That's it? Yeah. I didn't draw anything too good, so I'll just have to wait for my counterattack. Well, if you can't call anything at the moment, then I hope you don't mind if I go on the attack. It's my turn! Draw phase! Uh, stand phase! Main phase! I summon my Mender Droid and enter the attack phase! First, I'll have my Ruin Maker attack you directly with a gift check! Hmm. I'll no guard this one! Then gift check! Defensive maneuvers! No trigger! Whew. A no trigger! Damage check! A heal trigger! Yes! I get to recover one damage! See you later, Necromancer! You pulled a heal trigger on the second damage? Well, I guess it's only fair since I did the same thing earlier. Then in that case, I have my Mender Droid do a follow-up attack on you directly. And I want to get pay one to add a gift check. Oh no, guard this one too, Ika. Gift check. Keeper of technology, Shaylee. Another no trigger. A safeguard? It won't be easy breaking past you later, but I know I will. Damage check. Right of Awakening. A no trigger. I think I'm good to have my turn here. It's your move, Hayate. You're doing well in the attack, Ika. You've almost made us even, but I won't let you get too close. It's my turn! Draw phase! Main phase! Well, they can't all be winners. I have my turn, Ika. Again with nothing? Should I be worried? Eh, we'll see. Okay, then. Hattie hasn't made a move in two turns now. She's probably up to something. But what? Uh, it doesn't matter. Right now I have to press the attack with what I have and conserve my defenses for later. It looks like I'll be keeping on my attacks this turn. Drop phase, stand phase, main phase. I'll do nothing in the main phase and go right into the attack phase. First rule maker will go in for another direct attack with a gift check. Ha! Huh. I was waiting for that, Ika! Huh? When your creature attacks me, I can pay two and play my trap and send your rune maker to the top of your song! Go! Unforgiving wins! What? That means your attack has stopped dead in its tracks! I sent you the gift check, that means rune maker will just go back into your hand right after! So that's why you didn't do anything. You were saving your pay for this! You knew it! Well, that's a nice move, but it won't stop my attack. Next up, Mender Droid will go in and I'll add another gift check. I won't guard this one! Then here comes my gift check. Gift check. Keeper of technology, Shaylee. No trigger. Damage check. Right of Awakening. No trigger. And just like that, I knocked a Rune Maker out of the game! So that's why you agreed to let me summon it. Because you knew you could remove it with just two pay. Now I can't summon it at all. I must admit, Hayate, that's pretty sneaky. I know, right? I had to have had that plan at the ready when facing you. I thought you had a plan just for me, but I won't give in so easily just because you removed my Rune Maker from the field. Oh, I know you won't, and that's what makes it fun. As long as you've got fight left, then I'll be able to give it my all in response. It's my turn! Drop phase! Stand phase! My face down damage on put and main phase! Hmm... Almost. Almost? As in I'm almost ready for my attack. Next turn I'll start the counterattack. You sound so confident in it. How do you know it will work? I don't. But I don't know it won't work either. So I know there's a chance it will work. That's some interesting logic. 
But I promise no matter what you bring on your next turn, I'll survive it. I should make sure my defenses are at their best just in case. My turn! Draw face! <sighs> no! Huh? Stamp face! Mean face! That's the last one, so I can't rely on Room Maker anymore. It looks like I'll just have to play on my feet for the rest of the game. I go right into the attack phase and have Mendrodroid attack you directly with a gift check. Not going to happen! I paid two to use another unforgiving wins! You had another? That's right! Now just like your room make it will turn to the top of your song! Ugh! That also means my attack is nullified. But since there was a gift check, it comes back to my hand. I end my turn there. It's your move. There we go! Now your field is clear! Now nothing's stopping me from going on an all-out attack next turn! Even if you go all out next turn, you know you can't beat me. Maybe, but I know something you think I don't know! And with that information, I know I have the all-clear for an attack! Something you don't know? Wait, you don't mean- Okay, everyone, we've been waiting long enough, so it's time to go on the counterattack! It's my turn! Drum face! Stand face! Main face! Perfect! Huh? First I play another copy of Ferocious Wins, meaning I get to draw two cards after selling the top two cards of my song to the drop zone! Again, that's the third time this game! Well, I guess I'm just lucky that the cards I sent to the drop zone are Draw Trevor and Traveling Necromancer! Now I draw two cards! Perfect! Next I'll bring out a second Vicious Wrath, and using his effect we both discard one! I'll discard Cluster Phantoms! So this is how you plan to get rid of my hand? Well, thankfully I'm prepared. I'll discard a Ruin Maker droid. Hmm, then it's time to start the party. Let the winds blow fiercely throughout the land. Let's kick up a mighty storm. By discarding a second clustered phantom from my hand, I'll activate Vicious Wrath Renew. Now come on back, my favorite creature and trusted ally, Traveling Necromancer. And thanks to this, my spirit's blessing activates and gives every creature on my field 50 power. But I'm not done yet. By paying two, I use my Random Awakening, which now has renewed two since I summoned two creatures this turn. So I'll use it to bring back another Vicious Wrath. Mess with both spirits, blessing, and this is Wrath effect. We both discard one, and all my creatures gain 50 power. For my discard, I'll get rid of Childlike Wrath. Big creatures just like that. And you don't seem like you're anywhere near stopping. I think I'll discard another Ruin Maker droid. That means three already in the drop zone, so I'm doing good. To celebrate this, I'll keep up my renew by using Vicious Wrath skill by discarding the huge trigger in my hand in order to revive Childlike Wrath from the drop zone. Then, since he was special summon, Childlike Wrath gains 50 power. And thanks to Spirit's blessing, everyone gets another round of 50 power. Four creatures from Noah with all at least 150 power. That was quick. You know it, and we're about to put that power to use. I enter the attack phase and attack you directly with Vicious Wrath, and I'll pay my remaining one to add a gift check to the attack. I'll no guard this attack. But here comes my gift check. It's another Vicious Wrath. No trigger. Poof. Now I can survive the turn without guarding. Games check. Scrap metal. No trigger. That may be it, but I'll keep going. Childlike Wrath is up next with a direct attack. I know guard this one too. Damage check. Targeted missile strength. No trigger. The attacks are still on. Traveling Necromancer's coming in next with a total of 200 power. Uh, I know guard this one too. Damage check. It's a draw trigger. Yes, so I get to draw one card. Here comes the last one. I'll send my remaining Vicious Wrath in for a direct attack. Not so fast, Hata. By paying two when your creature attacks, I can play this. My targeted missile strength. Now your attacking Vicious Wrath is destroyed. No, Vicious Wrath. I'm sorry, but you fought hard. I hope to bring you back so we can battle again later. I have my turn there, Aika. It's your turn. That was something, Hata. You really put everything into those attacks. As per usual, when I go all in, I go all in. Yeah, that's just how you play. But since you formed a board from nowhere, I guess I'll just have to get rid of it. Huh? It's my turn now! Draw face! Stand face! Main face! First I'll send my room extra funds! Next I'll play this! My strongest spell! Last resort! Last resort? Right! I pay four when I have two less creatures that can destroy every creature on the field and do you one damage! Go! Last resort! Ah, uh, no! Everyone! <sighs> nice move, Ika! Getting rid of everything all at once again! But don't think it'll keep me down! Damage check! A damage trigger! That means I can send one damage your way! What? Ah, uh, damage check! Scrap metal! No trigger! I'm glad I destroyed your vicious wrath earlier with my trap, otherwise that would have been game over there. But now I've got to be really careful with my back to the wall like this. With nothing on your field to block me, I'll call back my render droid from earlier. Next time to my attack phase, attack you directly with render droid, and I'll pay one to add a gift check. I wish I could guard this, but I can't. No guard. Then my gift check. Render droid. A no trigger. Good. A no trigger. Damage check. Childlike wrath. No trigger. I survived the turn only taking two damage. Yeah, even with my attack, you're very good at holding on. But with only that vicious wrath in your hand, there isn't much to you can do. Wanna bet? Huh? Don't forget, Aika. As long as you fight with everything you've got, and that my song and I will respond with everything we've got. Every move we make has the chance to turn the tables and kick up a massive storm! Huh? Okay, everyone, we're doing it again! Going all out! It's my turn! Drop face, stand face, main face! Here comes Aika, our strongest storm yet! First, I'll summon the vicious wrath in my hand, and by using his ability, we both discard one. I'll discard my other remaining hand card, Clustered Phantoms! I can't say I didn't see that coming, but my discard will be my last Ruin Maker toy. I knew it! I knew you had drawn all of them! 
now that I have to drain my eye, I'll continue my story. I came to you in order to use Brand of Awakening, which will allow me to bring back from the drops so once again, traveling necromancer! Fear fears to come stay down, huh? That's right. As long as I'm still kicking, then I want to have him by my side. But first, since traveling necromancer special summon, both of my creatures will get 50 power from Spirit's Blessings. And by using his ability, I can pay three in order to renew three. Go, traveling necromancer! The creature I'll bring back will be my custard phantom, and through his effect, I'll make you discard one card from your hand. Another discard? This time I'll get rid of a damage trigger. Finally, I got rid of a card that can guard. Next, my spirit's blessing will once again trigger and give an additional 50 power to all my creatures. Now let's do this! I'm heading into the attack phase. I'll start off by having Vicious Wrath attack your better drone with 200 power. Nice time, but it won't let you break past so easily. I guard using a draw trigger. Then I'll keep up my attack with 150 power of Traveling Necromancer. Go! Soul Shock! Not going to happen, Hyote. I'll discard Keeper of Technology Shaley from my hand or to nullify your attack. Go! Safeguard! The messed up is closer to Phantom who has 200 power! I won't let this one go through either! Again! I'll discard Shaylin or to nullify the attack! Safeguard! You managed to survive the turn! Good job, Viper! But you know you're not out of the woods yet! Yeah, I know! With only three hand cards to my name and nine damage, it isn't looking good! But I'm nowhere near about to give up! It's my turn! Drop face! Stand face! Main face! Okay, this will keep me standing next turn. I summon another Mender to enter the attack phase. Here it comes. With nothing to defend with high power move both Business Rack and Travel Necromancer from the field, and leaving with no chance of combat. Bring it on, Aika. I'd like to see you try. Right. I'll send in one of my Mender droids for Traveling Necromancer, and I'll pay one time a gift check. No guard. Gift check. Another extra funds. No trigger. Don't worry, Necromancer. I'll bring you back next turn. Damage check. Huh? It's a damage trigger. What? That means one damage is going to you, Aika. Come on, son. I need a heal trigger to counteract the damage. Damage check. <sighs> Defensive maneuvers. No trigger. You win, Hayate. Yes! I did it! That's the power of our mighty storm renewal! Good game, Hayate. You had me on the ropes the whole time. What, really? If at any point you had attacked just a little more, the game could have been completely different. Especially at the end there when I had no hand clips. Yeah, but your damage trigger is kind of pretty handy. It's sending room maker back to the hand with unforgiving wins. Nice move. Thanks. I have to make sure I was ready for it. Your last reserve was also pretty good, too. <laughs> Thanks. Hey, maybe we should end this video now and continue our conversation later. Yeah, we can even call show to the girl. Why? Because you like it? No one asked, Aika! <clears throat> anyway, that marks the end of the video. We hope you guys enjoyed it. To see more fair content, don't forget to subscribe so we can stay going and hit the bell button so you know when we upload or set premieres like this one. And comment for some nice interaction and like the video. And maybe even share the video around so Darren can spread around faster. With that, I think we're both done, so we'll see you all later. Bye! Bye.